officers for local law enforcement and additional safety equipment for firefighters. Those were just some of the topics on the table at Wednesday's Helena City Administration meeting. MTN's Ali Kaiser was there and has more on the public safety levy and bond discussion. Helena Police and Fire Departments attended the Helena City Commission meeting on Wednesday night to look at ways of improving their services and it could affect your taxes. Helena clearly continues to grow and and so you know it, that just stretches those emergency services really thin and and so you know I think they made a good case that the need exists. In 2012, Helena had a population of 28,200 people. In a little more than a decade, it has grown to over 34,600 people, an increase of more than 6,400 people. I think tonight's meeting, we clearly got a pretty good financial picture of, of what we might be putting forward to the public, and they presented essentially three different tiers, they called them. The city is looking at additional fire and police personnel and the possibility of renovating Fire Station 2 or constructing a third fire station to serve the city's north side. Operating levies could range from around $796,000 to up to $3.1 million for both police and fire staff. According to city documents, that could raise property taxes on a home with a taxable value of $400,000, up to $170. City leaders would have to put a bond before voters to pay for the improvement of Station 2 or the construction of a new station. That could raise taxes on that same $400,000 home by another $30. Ultimately, we're putting this to the public for a vote, and it, if they approve it, it's going to be on their tax bills. And so... We've got to determine from the public what, what's their appetite for that. The commission will discuss the topic for a third of time before any decisions can be made. It must be approved before March 11th if it is to go on the June ballot. In Helena, Ali Kaiser, MTN News.